So here's your little lesson today on Horseshoe Crabs 101. So horseshoe crabs have been around about the same time as the dinosaurs, which is kind of tell you how old they are, I don't think that date. Um, but they live mostly in shallow waters, they're very heavily populated here in the Delaware Bay. And it's this time of year where the female, which is the bigger horseshoe, goes ahead and needs to lay its eggs. So a smaller male will cling to the back of it and they'll come on shore. She'll go ahead and barrel down into the sand lay her eggs and then the men, which are smaller ones again, will go ahead and try to fertilize them. And you'll notice which one's the male, which one's the female besides size. Um, they normally have, the male uh, normally surrounds the female, so normally it's about five to six males around a female. I just want to show you what a cluster of that actually looks like. This is a female, and this is a male. You can tell it's a pump on the back. And she's trying to bury herself into the ground so she can lay some eggs. Now normally when you find one on its back, you should probably help flip itself over, because if not, they're gonna die, or the seagulls will try to attack and eat it. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and just show you what the inside of one of them looks like, and then I'm gonna flip it back over. All the little legs and arms, or the stomach. And this is won't hurt you. They don't bite you. There's no teeth. Okay, now I'm gonna flip her over because I don't want her to die. So uh, give me a second here. 